Hi Libra, this is Jackie Tomlin, this is your general reading. This is for the week of May 17, 2021. Thank you guys for stopping by. If you're seeking a psychic reading, it is JackieTomlin.com. Um, also, to let you know, I am having reconstructive surgery done on my mouth here. So next week's videos will either not go up or be a couple days late. So hang in there with me. Now, if I do an extended video today, it will be on Vimeo. And the link to that and everything else I offer will be in the description box below. And you will find that by the black arrow below this video. Okay, so for the week of the 17th. What I'm looking at, Libra, you are going to have to dig for your patience. Delays are actually in your favor, and I really know that you don't want to hear that because I see it being very frustrating to you. Um, a little bit of an anger issue going on there. You are surrounded by healing energy, though, so the energy is really good. Uh, and for whatever reason, uh, Sagittarius and Capricorn may play a role in your life this particular week. So let's get started. We're starting with the Eight of Cups, letting the past go and moving forward. Not getting stuck in the past where the gray area is. The forward is, of course, the light shining, the new doors open, and the new opportunities. <clears throat> so it's letting you know it's okay to look in the past, but it's not okay to get stuck there. And we have the Ace of Swords. Now, the Ace of Swords is indicating a new beginning. That new beginning is now, but it's also in communication. Uh, communications as well as expressing yourself with that there is Libra and Libra King of Swords total and complete stubbornness wow guys you need to let that energy go then we have the five of coins two fold card two blessings and one card financial blessing as well as a spiritual blessing coming in from my labors center of the rating we have the ten of wands and i love the center of the rating because it radiates throughout ten of wands says you have gathered your obstacles you have pushed them off to the side you are creating a new path but you're creating a better path and with that look at there major arcana of the world as in the world is your oyster and taking the bull by the horns with that we have the sun the sun shines brightly in all that you do, and it's also bringing in new and different opportunities to my Libras. And we have the lovers. Strong in the love life. Whether you are single or whether you are a couple, it's going to be strong in the love life this week. And we have the Queen of Swords. Someone who might get a little catty with you. Someone who might have a little bit of a sharp tongue. Could also resonate as a Virgo energy. Now one thing that jumps out here before we start clarifying. There's a power couple here. King and Queen of Swords. That's going to be very significant here with those that lover's card. Alright, so let's start clarifying. See if we can go a little bit further with this. This is for Libra. What you need to know, this is your week of May 17th, 2021. All right, Libra. With that Eight of Cups comes the Three of Cups. Unexpected celebration. And I do want to throw out the word unexpected. Ace of Swords comes with love, love, love. The energy of the Seven of Wands. High vibration, positivity radiates, getting things done. And on top of that, look at there, Ace of Swords beside the Ace of Swords. Twice is telling you there is a new beginning. It's in communication and it's in expression. Five of uh, Pentacles comes with the Two of Wands. Two of Wands tells me you're making future travel plans. For some of you, this could be by water. Um, not like by boat, but like visiting water, river, lake, ocean, something to that effect. Ten of Wands comes the Six of Cups, reuniting with someone from your past. Uh, don't shoot the messenger because whoever this person is, I think it's your far distance past. But not only that, this is someone you're glad to reunite with. The world card comes with the hermit. Huge message there. Dig deep in your intuition because no matter what, Libra, this tells me you're on the right path. You're doing what you're supposed to be doing for the time being. 
and the sun comes with the four of pentacles four of pentacles says wise financial decisions investments savings um for whatever reason i want to say maybe you're investing in a piece of property as well okay and then i have the lover's card the lover's card comes with the empress the mother card positive changes on the home front and the queen of swords comes with the ace of wands the new beginning is now here in spring now if you're not in the u.s this is the remainder of may through the first two weeks of june bonus card for the center seven of cups everything going on this week including those delays they're going to frustrate you you have manifested you have bought it into yourself all right libra i think you've got a pretty interesting week going on i do want to continue with this so you will find the link to the extended uh, vimeo in the description box below this video and if not jackie for psychic readings and i'll see you guys soon